Greetings, travelers. I'm your host, the C-Dot that knows a lot, Dr. Waluigi. Well, it's Christmas time again, which means it's time once again to talk about the raccoons. Sadly, the last two specials aren't set during the winter season, but that isn't going to stop me from discussing this great Canadian series. With that being said, let's dive into the last two specials with The Lost Star and Let's Dance. I'm going to be skipping the history of this series because I've already gone over them in my last two videos, so check those out if you already haven't. With that said, the third special in the series is definitely the most unique in terms of story. As Schaefer and his family are out stargazing, Schaefer comes across one of Sneerl Sneer's bears who's trying to locate something. After Schaefer sneaks aboard his airplane, it takes off turning into a rocket that lands on another planet where many of the people he recognizes are fighting against Cyril as he prepares to send a fleet to conquer Earth. Can Schaefer and the others stop Cyril and his bears from invading the Earth? And how will Schaefer find his way home? The entire cast returns from the last special, as well as introducing the last of the main characters for the show. The first are the pigs, voiced by Keith Hampshire and Lynn Carlson, who are Cyril Sneer's new lackeys, and don't really serve any other purpose other than being the comic relief of the show. The other character they added is Brew, voiced by Sharon Lewis, whose only importance in the special is that he has the star that Cyril is looking for so that he can power his armada to conquer Earth. In terms of moving the story forward, Bruce seems to be the only important character in the whole special, but after this special gets treated as more of a background character. While the pigs were much more prominent and had a bigger role in the show, to the point of being main minor characters. If there's one thing that I think makes this special better than the other two is the premise. While I do like the simplicity of the other two, this one gives us an interesting story with some great conflict. On top of that, the music also makes a great return with a love song for Cedric and Sophia, and even a great escape song at the end for Brew. I really feel like this is the special that got a lot of kids, myself included, into the series. Which is a shame when comparing this to the last special that was made. If you guys haven't noticed by now, I don't have much to say about the last special, Let's Dance, as it's pretty much pointless and has no reason to be viewed. Let's Dance is a 22 minute long music video with clips from the previous specials with a minor plot revolving around Bert gathering everyone from the evergreen forest for a party. I wouldn't mind this special as much as this type of special wasn't as common for the time it came out. But with today's technology and how easily it is to make this kind of video on YouTube, the special no longer has any special meaning outside of the 80s. Hell, you can find the entire album on YouTube for free rather than watching the special on any other platform. I still feel like the third special is worth checking out if you can find it. I don't think it's the best of the show, but I find it to be the best of the specials with the most unique plot. As for the final special, I wish I could say anything positive about it, but it's only worth seeing if you like the music from the series. But as I said, you can find the whole soundtrack on YouTube if you want to listen to it. Either way, these specials have rekindled my childhood, and I can't wait to review the series next year. I give the third special an 8 out of 10, and the fourth special a 1 out of 10. Not bad for being the last specials of a criminally underrated and unknown show. Thanks for watching, I'm Dr. Waluigi, and remember, don't judge a book by its cover, because you'll never know what's inside. Good night, everyone. Up in the frat house, me and you, and you know what I'm there to do. We're drinking and kissing, what comes next? You and I have S-C-X. Oh, I didn't know.